Okay, now that we finished that quest, what's next? I can't get to that quest guy up there. I don't know. I need to learn the layout of this city again. I, oh, I say again. I never learned it the first time. I need to learn the layout of the city. Who's this guy? Oh, yeah. He was the, um... The dude that wants the uh, ancient vessel thingies. Who's this guy? What? What is all this? Blue gleam? Oh, that's from the, um, blue gleam is from, uh, the expansion, right? You need a blue gleam for something. I remember. Process metal blocks. Why not buy these? Let's see what these boxes actually hold. Oh man. Shard gambler's box? Wall. Okay, so dark boxes give you Ooh, skins. Deku, I'm gonna buy the longest cable and use it just to spite his stubborn ass. Woof. Koopo gonna zzzz. Yeah, tomorrow I'll be up all night. All right, Koopo. We'll see you tomorrow, friend. Get yourself some good sleep. Thanks for stopping by and hanging out with us as always. Arrested two for disorderly conduct. All right, so where is this quest guy? Damn you, I'm going to find you. I jumped through openings, got gotcha. you. Found him, though. Naman? I'm the mournful Naman. My apologies that we meet like this. Like this? In grief. You hold yours close. Like a talisman. Wait, forgive me. You didn't come for reparations. Kupo was trying to fix the sentence. Tomorrow is supposed to be after oh, no. night. <laughs> I know about the red raids, but the Karja owe me nothing. I see. Well, I could use the help of a strong-willed outlander. Then I would owe you very much indeed. These people seek to honor their loved, their lost, with their own voices. Not mouthing Karja rituals to Karja stone. But there are obstacles. And while Meridian holds its breath for any disturbance, these robes only tie my hands. What rituals? Simon, rituals and prayers can't bring back those who are lost. No. But it can help those who grieve to find themselves. It can lend them strength and hope, like a new sunrise. If I could help, what must be done? The first pilgrim is an Asaron who seeks to visit the Shrine of Kings on the road to the city. He waits there now, forbidden to enter by an old sun priest who suffer no heathen. He'll this suffer no heathen. Taro lost her companion on the edge of the jewel at a pool where snap moths gather. A shrine was built there to ward off the machines, and its effectiveness leaves much to be desired. And the Manuk would paint a mark on the sun's climb call to the machine spirits I understand they need no beckoning flint hawks perched there drawn to the spires shining so clear the machines out of two shrines and move a priest out of the other all I can ask for is your charity and that their stories are heard okay uh, then to honor them Always something to do in this city. 
Actually, where's, what's the main quest? Let's, let's focus on that for now. It appears Aaron... What is the City of the Sun? Oh, that's... What? That was close to where we were. Damn you, game. Damn you. We were up here. Well, we have a campfire there whenever we want to go to that one. So into the borderlands. Meet Aaron at the Palace of the Sun. Okay. Whew. This game's got a lot of running in it. <laughs> Boom, 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 boom. Who's this person? You're looking for our... Yes, but I'm no <clears throat> profiteer. Sun King Avad has named me an envoy to the... I work on their behalf, looking for sacred relics to return to their homeland, Ben-Ur. Ben-Ur. I'm especially interested <clears throat> in wooden figures that are sometimes found... Oh, so this lady wants the Banuk figurines. Gotcha, gotcha. Let's trade. What you, you got? Ready? Hey, we can get this one. Ooh. What you got for me? Okay, okay. Let's see Come what's in that box. Excuse me, Outlander. I'm look. Five hundred metal shards. Modification, 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 modification box. Shit, 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 shit. That's all garbage. Mm, I actually need to buy some new body armor at some point. This what I've been using is kind of bad. So with this rope caster, what should you build for? Tear? Because I guess yeah, it says tear 150. Yeah, okay. But I'm already using this for tear. Feels bad. Eh. Let me see if there's anything else I can equip here. 14% freeze. 24% freeze. Oh, I really don't have anything good. I do as far as this is concerned. 16% resist melee attack. 7% versus fire. Resist corruption solid. Ooh. We'll use that for now. But I do need to focus on some armor at some point. What does this guy sell? Oh, this is the that person could you spare a moment to speak of the finer things after being one shot by that that thunder jaw kind of makes me uh no one goes into the palace makes me want to get station. upgrades wait what what's this guy saying Greetings, Aloy. I am known as Blameless Marad. Please come with me. You're needed for an important consultation. What do you mean? Where's Erend? He's inside, attending the Sun King, where we should be without further delay. Follow me, please. All of these people are here to see the Sun King. Yes, and each has come to ask a favor of him. Unpleasant, but that's politics. The Sun King is eager to meet you. Oh, I'm coming. It's all very intriguing. I'm not here to intrigue you. Too late. This guy sounds like a young Morgan Freeman. Well, that's too late. <laughs> These people so salty. Oh shit, that armor looks so sick. Give me that. Look at that dude! That helmet looks dope! Ignore them. Nobles are like children who whine when they don't get a second helping of dessert. Looks like something out of For Honor. What's I need to play For Honor sometimes with, with you guys. Is what he isn't like. His father. I think 
I find him to be a reasonable man. Aloy of Venora. She who sees the unseen. Welcome. It would seem you have done me a great service. Something Errand. Errand. Tell her what you found. I, I checked Ursa's tomb. You were right, Aloy. The body is missing a scar below her right knee. I gave it to Ursa when we were kids, fighting over a toy sword. If the body is not Ursa's, then we must assume she is still alive. And I will not abandon her. We only know she was taken, not who took her. I can help with that. Ursa has an enemy among the Osara. A warlord named Durval. Impossible. Every clan in the claim has been hunting for him since the liberation. He has to be dead by now. No other Osoran had the motive and ingenuity to lure Ursa into this trap. I expect to find him lurking somewhere near the border. I've already sent an agent to investigate. He'll be waiting for word from us at the marketplace in Pitchcliffe. I can't move troops to the border without provoking the Osoran. But I could send a few vanguardsmen. And perhaps an exceptionally gifted Nora as well. Errant, Murat, let me discuss it with her privately. Dude, guys are so creepy towards Aloy. Like they just walk up on I her, like. Impose further after all you've done. Like, calm this down, is a man. Of great importance to me. Orion, that was hilarious. You were ready to wreck it, and it destroyed you in two seconds. The Thunderjaw thing. All right, so here's this Durval character. Who is Durval exactly? To understand Durval. You must first understand my father. He truly thought of himself as a sun god. His mind was broken. He believed that blood sacrifice would solve, well, everything. So he raided the other tribes for victims, especially the Asura. Durval fought back. He crafted powerful weapons and rallied his people. My father responded with the ultimate cruelty. He captured Durval's wife and daughter and sacrificed them in the Sun Ring. So why would Durval go to so much trouble to kidnap Ursa? He felt she betrayed him. She fought by his side until she realized he planned to raise Meridian and butcher its people. And she came to me. Together, we stopped him and liberated the city from my father. Durval has spent every moment since trying to get revenge. Mostly on the other Asuram who fought with us. He made so many powerful enemies. I thought we'd seen the last of him. I was wrong. Okay. I need to get going. I know. Well, they say kings should never beg. But please, help me find Ursa. Who says that? Well, Murad, for one. Don't hesitate to ask him or Aaron if you have further questions. Okay. Founding of Marit. Whoa, about jumped off that wrong spot. Something else over here. Come on. Stand for me. There you go. La Sunking. Where do we gotta go now for this quest? Pitchcliff. A uh, damn! They're trying to send me all over the map. Okay. Well, this is good because we need to go here for a quest. We're going to knock that out as we make our way up. Double the XP, double the fun. Go ahead. Ah. Okay, so let's go southeast. 
See what's up. Whoa, hello. Let's get on with it. So one fire almost kills these things, huh? I'll take it. We're up to 1100 metal shards. Next time I run into a vendor, I'm going to check out what uh what we can purchase as far as armor goes. I feel very very squishy. Help. See nothing, you see nothing, you see nothing. Look out. That was a big whiff. Yeesh. Bitch slapped. Yeah, you want to get up off of that one. I keep hitting R3 like I'm gonna target. <laughs> Okay, what am I supposed to do in here? Actually, real question is how do I get in here? Oh. At least they give you tons of healing right here. This is actually a good spot to farm. I'm sure there's better later on, but for now, shit. To hit this place up. How do I get into this shithole? Definitely squishy based on that damage taken. I'm telling you, man, I get a pow every time something touches me. I didn't keep up very much of my upgrades, though. I will soon. I'm going to make a complete circle around this thing before I figure out how to get up it. You watch. Is there a cave? Hmm. The fuck? Oh, horses. <laughs> You're doing good so far, though. I'm happy. I haven't hit a choke point yet where there's something I can't do. I'm sure it's coming, but for now. Snap mall site. Okay, I didn't see a single entrance into this place. Wait, found you. Or not. Trust me, game, I can do this all night. I will find a way <laughs> to soft lock myself, possibly. I like how they stick one bush up here to hide in. Are you serious? start falling like that and you can't stop scary times I 
I should probably just stop trying to BS my way in here. What about here? Nothing. How in the hell do I get into this place? Maybe it's a... Oh, hello. fun with this ravager oh, 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 oh. oh you want some too crap boy let's go oh my god who else wants some of Debo we got 28 shots left let's go That's the wrong thing. Holy shit, that was sick. Uh oh. Sakaris, so, what's going on? This is hands down one of the best games on the PS4. That, I agree. Oh, what is he doing? Like, I'm having a blast with it so far. Ow. Dude, they're... oh, actually, you know what? He is not weak to that at all. What? Let's go on fire. <laughs> Knock some more pieces off of him. Convoy was actually fun to get right there. Jesus. <laughs> Orion, oh, I just realized you haven't seen Deathbringers yet. Deathbringers? I have it. That doesn't seem very, uh... Doesn't seem very promising, though. <laughs> Told you the gun fucks them up. Yeah, I didn't understand that the gun was that strong. Holy crap, man. Shh. New way to play this game for sure. The cars, I love this game. Make sure you beat the DLC before the main story, though. You get more help. See, I actually played through the DLC when it released, but I never finished the game. Like, right now, where I'm currently at, I'm actually farther ahead than I ever was uh, in my, well, I guess, original playthrough. I've been telling people, though, like, when this game came out, I got sucked into playing um, Breath of the Wild. And... I mean, not, it's not taking away from Breath of the Wild or taking away from this game either. They're both really good games. It's just I chose to play Breath of the Wild and never got back into this, sadly. Now that I am, though, oh, my God. I'm enjoying the shit out of it. <laughs> Ryan, unfortunately, he beat the DLC before he beat the main game, but he'll do story before DLC this playthrough. Yeah. Yeah, I was going to play through the uh, main story and then go do the DLC again on the... Uh, the stream playthrough. If I can ever figure out how to get into this hole. I don't know though. Running into those monsters right there. Or running into the robots. Felt pretty good. Oh, well, you see nothing. She wop. What? Damn. He actually nailed me with that. <laughs> Not alone. That teleport though was sick. Shit. Wait, do we got more? What the what? Same place. Uh, 
That was a whiff. Oof. Oh wow, fire damage actually hurts people pretty good too. I mean, of course, you're burning things. That was a whiff. Honestly, the DLC doesn't fall at the end. Story-wise, you can fit it in whenever story-wise. Oh. I mean, I don't even remember the story uh, of the DLC. I remember it took me a while to play through the uh, expansion, though. Pretty good content. Anything that takes more than, like, four to five hours to complete. It took me a while to do it. I'm actually guessing that we get to get up here. If I got to jump right here... I'm gonna be mad. Oh my god. I hate this game. <laughs> I just made the whole circle right there. Ryan, you missed his first meeting with a Thunderjaw. It was entertaining. <laughs> yeah, that Thunderjaw fucked me up. Within seconds. I was getting prepped to jack him up, and it was just like, whoop, one shot. Learning experience, though. Then I got a tail to the face. That was another learning experience. ancient things back to life their power serves us machine demons from beneath the ground it's a nightmare nightmares yes the worst dreams of our enemies come true yes oh so these guys are bringing these dudes back what oh my will destroy us all they will only destroy our enemies and bring us back the lands that were ah! 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 stop working search the area we may have intruders intruders forgive this intrusion Aloy you left me Brian no but now you got it down Pat it's like it's good when you learn like that party. you know now the focuses are disabled, but I don't know for how long. The rest is up to you. Who is this? What? Who is this dude? Weakness is tear for the spike launcher. Let's go. Whoa, that's the wrong button. I'm bad about my control still. Okay, so let's see. You know what? We'll rack in two. Stand still for one second. All right. There you are. They're scanning for me. Nora girl lives. Kill what? her. No, you had your chance. We removed a component. I'm happy with that. So these things are corrupted, right? Oh. Whoa, we still got some kind of a launcher. There's fire. Not so. Oh. That thing just chunked a rock at me. That's the first time I've seen that. getting rickrolled by rocks feels bad jesus all right eject shit for damage Woo. 
Should have done this well beforehand. Who needs stealth, right? All right. Small bit of reprieve. Let's see if we can take out these other guys. Trying her damnedest to jump me. Man, I'm sucking with my aim tonight. What is going on? Ooh, if I need to farm Blaze so bad, it was bad. What up, me? I kind of miss my freeze uh, sling trap right now. <laughs> or sling, slinger, whatever it's called. Shoo up. I don't want to waste ammo on that thing. fire all right now calm down and actually learn to shoot Jeff let's go and don't fall don't fall whatever you do don't fall <laughs> feels bad <laughs> Olin's a badass over here. With an arrow sticking out of well, he had an arrow sticking out of him anyway. Metal burn. Wait, what? Don't ever ask me to be your sniper in COD. <laughs> yeah. Woo. Deaf and stealth, that's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> Hear me out. Dude, I was expecting to break those parts this off like ASAP. Like Damn, Olin, you got up here really quick. Hang on. Oh, he's down here. Why did he suddenly fall down? I'm ready. I'm ready. I promise. I'll tell you everything. I know you will. The killers who came for me at the Proving, who are they? The Eclipse. Some kind of holy warriors. A cult of the Shadow Karja. The Eclipse? Shadow Karja? Except they're not like any Karja I've known. They don't pray to the sun. They worship some kind of devil. I'm not interested in their superstitions. Oh, it's not a superstition. Their devil is real. It has a name, a voice, the most terrible voice, and they do its bidding. Okay. What are these Eclipse cultists after besides me? They never said, but given the Karja civil war, they must want to overthrow Sun King of Arden and take Meridian back. 
What do I have to do with that? I don't know. When they attacked the Proving, a man came for me. Tall, strong, dead eyes. Helis. Helis. He? Terror of the sun. Stacker of corpses, we Osram called him when he was the Mad Sun King's champion. If only he'd died with his king. But now he leads the Eclipse. I tell you, he's the most dangerous man alive. You say this devil, the Eclipse worship, has a name? Hades. That's what they call it. Hades. And you've heard it speak? Steal to my soul. I heard. Just once, when it saw you. Such a voice. A cold, awful jangle. It scrapes your bones. It hollows your guts. A metal sound. But like nothing dug from the earth or smelted in a forge. And what did it say? System threat detected. Just three words. But in the voice of a devil. Huh. How did the Eclipse recruit you? I know they took your family hostage, but why you? I was a scrounger, a rummager in dark places, good at what I do. I suppose they knew I would serve them well as a scout. I had taken a delve near Maker's End. When I surfaced, they were waiting. I laughed when I saw the priest, but then he showed me Helis's encouragement. I didn't laugh after that. They gave me a focus to watch my every move. I followed orders. You had access to Meridian. Why didn't they get to Avad through you? Too much dirt under my nails for an audience with the one true Sun King. But whatever Ursa or Aaron told me, the Eclipse heard every word through my focus. That's why I couldn't warn you. If I tried, they would have killed my family. But what about now? Wouldn't they kill his family? Why they are the Eclipse see? digging up ancient machines? And how do they get them to work? I thought they wanted them for scrap, but they brought them back to life. Plugged some kind of device into the corpses so that Hades could whisper to them and call them from their grave. I've fought that kind of machine before. Are there others? Yes. The ones you fought today, they call corruptors. But there are others, much bigger, bristling with ancient weapons. Those they call Deathbringers. Deathbringers. I've only seen them buried in the ground, but after today, anything is possible. Sounds to me like they're raising an army. If so, the world will fall. And I helped dig the pit. The Eclipse were sent to kill me because I look like another woman. Older, maybe twice my age, short hair. Who is she? As your mama. I don't know. My focus found her image once in the ruins of Maker's End. Maybe you can find her there. You found her image in the ruins? How? There was a door beside it, a kind of ancient device that contained the woman's image. My focus recorded the location. You do look like her. Is she your mother? I'm the one asking questions. Uh, uh. I've heard enough. It's time to finish this. I won't beg for my life. But if there's any mercy in you, free my family. Please. Where would I find them? My focus recorded the location. There are always guards there. You look like you can handle yourself. Do we actually get a choice to kill him? It will take many good deeds to make up for the crimes you've committed. You're sparing me? After all I've done? Yes. We're nice peoples. We save him. Forge a new life, Owen. <laughs> One of better make. Then the rest of my life will be lived in your dead. Go to the place where your family is being held and wait for me. We'll make their lives the first ones you save. I didn't earn this mercy, but I will die to make myself worthy of it. I will be waiting for you. He just gave me the most shifty eye. He's just like. 